gonna demonstrate how to use my new favorite curling iron. This one I stumbled upon at Walmart and it was about 30 bucks. So I think it's a little pricey for drugstore. However, it does amazing things to your hair. It's called the U Wrap and Wave Styler. And I picked this up because it was very unique to the other curling irons that I have. Not only does it have a double barrel, but it also opens up like so. I'll demonstrate two ways on how you can use this. Um, this one I have more of the controlled wave. It gives lots of volume without having to tease. On my right side I have the more kind of crazy like diva-ish hair. I'm going to start off by sectioning our hair to the bottom layer. Before I apply any heat, I'm going to use a heat protectant and spritz this all over. And I'm just going to wrap the hair around the curling iron. I'm not even going to open up the clamp. Let it sit for about six seconds and then release it. And this is the kind of curl you're gonna get. It's not it's not gonna be your typical curl because it is more of a wider curl. You see that? It's pretty interesting. And once it all comes together, it'll be nice and big. And I'm gonna go ahead and continue curling away from my face. Here's the final look of the curls, and it's amazing how defined the curls are. So just watch this as I run my fingers through. Look how beautiful this is. You can also brush out your hair to get a soft effect. Isn't that quite amazing? Now I'm just going to add a little bit of this argan oil. Just a little bit on my hand. And then run this through. And there you go. That's how you do it when you wrap your hair outside of the curling iron. I'm just going to slip on the little cute glove that it came with. And then this time I'm going to wrap the hair in between the two barrels. So just open up your clamp. Put it in and then I'm going to do this eight figure shape. Like this. And then clamp down. Let it hold for about six seconds and then I'm going to release. See the shape that it gives? This one will take a little bit more time, but as you can see, it's very interesting, um, unique shape. And here's what it looks like when you open up the barrel and you do the S-shaped curl. So let's do the same thing as we did on this side. I'm going to run my fingers through, and I imagine this to be way bigger, kind of more crazier curls. Wow. Check that baby. I've never seen my hair like this without teasing it or anything. This is crazy. Again, I'm going to add a little bit of oil just to give it a really nice soft feel to the hair. Some of the features to this curling iron, there's not one bad thing I'd have to say with this. It comes with a mini half glove. When I do weave the hair around the curling iron, I do use this because you're more likely to um, touch the barrel. The iron itself is wonderful. It has a swivel cord, so you're not tangling anything up with the cord. It does have different heat settings. So, so it starts off at 310 to 330 to 360 to 400. Me, I put this curling iron all the way up to 400 degrees because I have more thick hair. If you do have thinner hair, you don't have to bring it all the way up to 400. It does have a lock and unlock. So if I open up the barrel, I'm able to lock it so it stays open like that. Oh my gosh, I can actually do different size curls with this. I just realized, darn it. It is lined with tourmaline ceramic, so it does give you the shine effect in your hair. And it does heat up really fast. It heats up in 30 seconds, so that's amazing, especially for a drugstore product. I've only seen it at Walmart, but I'm sure you can find it at other drugstores. So anyway, thanks so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.